Good day. If you were like me and you've just got your Android TV box and you're all excited about it and you go to the Google Play Store and suddenly realise Amazon Prime is not there. We, we can't install it in Australia. So there has to be another way and there is. This video will show you how to install Amazon Prime including audio. We're going to do a quick search for Aptoid which is an Android TV uh, replacement, I suppose you could say, for Google Play Store. And we just simply download it. Just take the latest one. It won't take long to download. The Aptoid APK, you need to copy it across to your USB drive. I've already right-clicked and I'm just going to paste it into here. And uh, that's basically all we need for the computer. We now need to go over to the MeCool uh, box itself and we'll pop this into the side and we'll do the next bit of the installation. Turn on the TV, load up the MeCool Android box, pop in the little SD card and you can see the system is now checking. We then go to the sidebar, open FX, go across to the SD card itself, open up the Aptoid APK and start loading it. Now of course we want to install it so we click install. We take a couple of seconds then you click done and the app will start to open you need to install it which we do we click on install and yes we allow the access and we allow that again and we let it do its job once it's installed we go to the settings we have to turn the settings to allow it to do what it's got to do which we do there turned on we reboot and start the app and we're going to go down to Aptoid and open it from the side load bar it'll take a few seconds to open and once it's open we will then go to the little uh, search button down the bottom there we're going to type in Prime Video and to allow it to search we click on the little um, magnifying glass on the other side which is the search bar we select we don't select this one not the prime video we want the one down next for Android TV that's the one we want so we click on that and we go to install and again it takes a few seconds to get fired up and we click on install down the bottom and as you can see it's installing nicely I like to reboot the system. It's really probably not necessary, but it's just something that I've always done. And now we've rebooted, we go across to Favorites button and we select Prime Video. And we now click on Prime Video. It'll now open the program itself. Now we have to continue, obviously. You will need to enter your email address or your mobile number and a password. I'll do that off camera. We ask for an account verification. You'll be given a enter your code which you can see there. Now you must have a computer handy. You use the primevideo.com slash my TV, enter that in and you type in that uh, number, the code that you were given. Once you've done that, you're successfully registered as you can see here. We then click on continue and uh, we have to wait a few seconds and then surprise surprise Amazon Prime pops up and there it is. Now I'm going to go from screen capture which you're looking at at the moment to a camera view so you can hear that audio is actually working as well. And uh, what I'll do I'll just uh, click on oh, that one I'll do Amazon original and what we want to do is see whether we can actually get sound which I'm hoping we will well oh, nice reflection of me how about that cookery book here steamed rain comes with black beans and chilies okay I won't run it for too long because obviously I'll get a copyright strike so there you have it Amazon Prime Australia is working the audio is also working and um, no complaints from me 
Thanks for watching. Catch you on the next video.